Winter, many communities are experiencing an uptick in COVID-19 cases. Destiny Polster speaks with doctors on what they're seeing here in South Mississippi. Up to a dozen people a day are being diagnosed with COVID at Singing River Health System's Ocean Springs Hospital Clinic. Dr. Stephen Demetropoulos says that's out of the 70 to 80 patients the clinic sees a day. You know, that's about a 10 to 15 percent test rate of the people, of everybody that walks in for any other problem. He says the increase is making the viral illness harder to avoid. COVID is becoming now like the flu. It's what we call endemic, meaning it's just kind of uh, part of the illnesses that cycle through um, the community. Dr. Demetropoulos says many people are using at-home COVID-19 tests when they feel ill. He says that doesn't always provide the right diagnosis. But if they're positive, they're positive. Where that test falls down is that it has um, false negatives, so maybe we may not pick up COVID when we should. A false negative could be dangerous for high-risk individuals. Paxlovid, an antiviral drug used to treat COVID-19, is often used for those higher risk patients. What it does is reduce your chance for a hospitalization and pretty profoundly greater than 90 percent in the people that take it. Aside from Paxlovid, Dr. Demetropoulos says getting vaccinated can also help. Frequently people come in and I'll elderly particularly and I'll test them and they'll be positive they'll go, wow, I didn't even realize I had COVID. I, I don't really feel that bad and they're fully vaccinated. The benefit of the vaccination is that it mutes the severity of the illness, so they're not as ill. And medical experts say to continue washing your hands and if you feel sick, wear a mask. Safety precautions like these can help stop the spread along the coast. In Ocean Springs, Destiny Polster, WLOX News Now.